What is up everyone, I am Gibby Hero and today I have a little bit different video for today. I want to show you some stuff. Well, because the post office house, the old one, have been sold to a few people now and the social workers need to get out the old stuff for people don't do to have all this crappy old stuff. And my mom asked, can I have a few of these uh, gas masks? And they said, yeah, they throw it out, out in the one pile for burning into the, down the road. And one interesting uh, said that said these were a lot of old Soviet Union gas masks in case of shelling would happen. And I had to drive to the city after a few minutes, so I needed to use my bike time efficiency to get as much as I can. But I still wished I could get uh, so much more. So they were a lot of these masks the little ones, especially for little kids. They they were in the school to practice how the gas masks work and would protect themselves in case of shelling. And there were a lot of in the old schools and some houses too. These are a little small for me and a few people, but still they're fun functional with all the cases and filters down the road, so yeah. Now we have the bigger ones for bigger people. And smaller people can use these too, like the bigger gas masks without the tube so these are a little bit hard to use because when you have the tube ones you can maybe if they're longer tubes you can stretch it into your pocket under your belt to put the the can to yourself so it's not too hard to carry on but these ones don't have any any tube so you need to all the way down here it's not that hard if you use the smaller ones uh, but like if you try to use this one big, it's really really heavy and you screw this up, it's really heavy for you to use. Yeah. So talking about the cans, there were a lot of uh, unpackaged. This this paper is the packaging for the whole cans. And they are still still new. Uh, the color is still on, the, everything is locked up. You can still open this the rubber protector. Of course it's, it's a little, little bit dusty because it's been beer for years, maybe decades over here but it's still kind of usable maybe the filters that are on are oxidizing and there's not usable but by the cans cans are totally new and they're still usable and there are a lot of different cans I put some new there are a lot of these I uh, pick up these there's a really really cool ones and yeah and this one is was open it was real it's really big and really heavy but it's all dusty and rusty and yeah you can see a little bit the top filtering has been down and so you can see a little bit over here uh, nothing big huge for you open before you open because you can do it otherwise and as I said this is the bigger one I think you can still open this still the hole open for you to breathe you need to just untouch this little thingy over here and yes the filter is still a little bit on so yeah for like smaller uh, masks with tubes has been really perfect because you can stretch it over here or hold in your hands but uh, if I said it's bigger you need to all this weight on your face so it's hard to use these really and I have these filter packs these are packs still in package but still oxidized because of all of these decades the filter packs I don't know how to use these on because all these have been covered and I don't know how to open these these are in sealed so nothing can get inside or outside of this but uh, it seems you can replace these somehow with some some tubes or cans for the gas masks and of course I got a few of these these are the old Soviet respirators uh, may I may show you one of these later on but these are super old and one problem with these these are really crappy these were for some painting or stuff like that dusty and it's been coating into the soft power alone and this is really bad because after all these years I opened one up and after 10 seconds I tried to get out all this green power alone fall, fall off and yes some of this power alone came into the mask and it's really bad you, you could not breathe this because if you you could get some uh, power alone inside your lungs it would be really really crappy about that so I have two of these and one started up for, for my demonstration I will show later on and I would say the last thing I have is like an epic loot uh, because I found this authentic bag I don't know it's is maybe for the most important man in the building or the teacher or some marine could use this because this is a rare green gas mask uh, it has it looks like uh, uh, these little ones for kids with the same mechanism to close them uh, but it has a one rubber plating uh, in the back side 
and it's a lot of bigger and less stronger and it's only one green only green mask I found there uh, and the thing is uh, it's already detached to connect it to one the big big can over here and it's already open so I think it's not usable anymore but it's still 100% authentic so you would walk with the mask on your face and the tube here in the back so it was really really rare find to find some of this stuff because there's only one there and that's really rare for now for these times so I put my hair together and picked out this respirator so it's yeah the green parallel and awful laugh you can see a little bit of the edges and stuff and yeah I think that a few metal pieces or water has come off so it's a little purple stuff and that's dangerous too so I'm gonna just quickly put this on yeah it's kind of, it works kind of like this it's really stuff for like painting or quick work and it's actually kind of hard to breathe and talk at the same time seems the filters are really old so yeah I, w I wouldn't recommend to use these I would recommend to buy these new uh, big packs that you can replace the filter sound because these are one time use well few times then you can need to throw with this out and I think I'm gonna use the one of these big masks to show you how to put on maybe show I actually put only one one these uh, one only one time for yesterday damn it Ta -da! I don't know if you can hear me if I if you do so uh, I don't actually know so I uh, let you show you this thing so yeah you screw the filter on and you open this one up but yeah so cabbage so now you can breathe I I sorry I put out the mask because I could not breathe because the filter were closed off. So here you go. So you could breathe something and this is filter inside, so that's how it works. It looks a little bit tricky on me, but anyway. So yeah, that was the quick demonstration for them. I, I wasn't gonna pick up these because they're a little small and the bands used there, they're really hard to use. So yeah, anyways, that was the stuff. So yeah, I really happy for this haul, I don't know, you may ask why did I do this, why did you get, because these are really rare items uh, for nowadays and you can sell these for a lot of money or for to collectors, maybe some, make some props or redesign them and sell at some festivals like you could uh, <clears throat> break open the from the line of this mask so you can make a little bit different with like bands, elastic so you can make, maybe you can make Smackling mask or stuff like that because these are really usable strong rubber strong glass covered everything is sealed down So none of gas or stuff will get inside of you So these are really really good stuff and I'm really proud that I get this Special rare green mask that that's really good for collection. I'm still gonna clean all of these up because there's still dirt in the in the glass and all this stuff is really old and all these masks are still dirty, really, really dirty. And yes, so yeah, thank you very so much for watching this whole video. Uh, this was my showcase of uh, Soviet Union gas masks in case the shelling would happen. And don't forget to leave like, comment, and subscribe. And goodbye, people.